So I just want to show you now how I would do edge wrap in a traditional comp. So I've basically got my alpha here. So there's my alpha and I blurred it by 25 pixels. And then I did a merge node and I changed the merge to a stencil. So it gave us this. So I had a little play and I made a background image. I made it with AI. I'm sorry, I couldn't help myself. It's quick. And so I'm, I apologize if this means something really terrible. Um, but I just need a background with some contrast and bright light to kind of see roughly how you would do edge wrap in the, in the olden days when you did post compositing outside of Unreal Engine. Okay, so I've got my background and then I've got my foreground. Here we go. And then um, we're just putting him over the background here. So there he is, over the background. And traditionally, what you'd like is some of this light wrapped around him. Now, if I did a glow, this is a glow, which is kind of like a bloom. It's kind of adding some light wrap uh, around the, the guy. And, but it's also adding it to the background as well. So um, often on my shots, I'll have a little bit, I'll have a touch which just blends everything together. But if you've got lots of atmospherics already in your shot, it's gonna kind of, uh, kind of add on top of those and, and that sort of stuff. So you just wanna apply it to him. And that's why I'm doing this edge wrap mat um, for the character. So if we go back into our result, and then what we want to do is take this background and then we blur it. So we want some of this light to bleed onto him using that mat here. So basically we do an A of a B with that mat. If we pull it on, so it's, we're taking that blur with that mat and putting it on top of him. There we are. And then we put it over the environment. So now we've got that blurring. I'm gonna knock it back a bit. So blurring and we're just wrapping some of that over, over the character and it just helps sit them in a bit more and it's so I'm just going to extend that a bit and then knock it back a bit like that so there's a, a little bit of that light contamination around it and it just helps sit them in and then if I move move them around let's try and put them over here he should take some of this blue collar with him uh, move it in the X so now there we've got some of this blue kind of light blooming over him and uh, I'll make it stronger just so you can kind of see it so let's just go like that. So we're going a bit crazy, not to taste. This is just for demonstrative purposes. And then I'm going to move him to the other side of the screen. So now he should be a bit more orangey. <laughs> Too orangey for crows. Sorry. All right. And then <laughs> there we go. 